how do we describe writers? And it's the same thing. I, I've said before, uh, I took a whole bunch of photographs, but then what makes me a photographer? Anyone can take a photograph. Anybody can be a writer. And that's why I keep saying to people, anybody can write. You know, but what makes you a writer? A writer is one that puts a lot more sweat equity, you know, perseveres, and tries to get her own book, she has her own book published. That's what it makes you a writer. But the whole idea is that anybody can write. And we, we try to encourage people to, to you know, take that on. And even this, in, in this new generation, 20 years after, we're still pioneering. Because there's a whole generation of new writers out there writing completely different things. You know, diverse in ideas and thoughts. And it's the very first time that you actually see the emergence of a, li a true literature that was not just confessional, not about the past, not about ourselves personally, but about things, about what we look at and how we see ourselves. So I think it's unique. Um, and, you know, and from here, we're going to have to transform it much further than that. And what we need to do is that we need to then encourage you know, this new generation of people to not just get involved with writing their own material, but to try to somehow give, you know, put themselves in the situation to help the rest of the community. Because if you look at it, 20 years ago, we had nothing. You know, it's not too far ago. And so, you know, we still got quite a bit of ways to go. And that's the work that we have to do. I first met Jim probably 20 years ago. And uh, soon after, he invited me to edit Rice Paper, even though I had no experience and <laughs> perhaps no gift for it. But um, it was a way for him to get me to challenge myself and to believe in myself and to expand my ways of thinking about writing and to be part of a community. I am forever grateful to Jim for everything and uh, for supporting me and so many so early on um, and, and believing that we had something of value to say.